Now to Genesee County, where investigators are working to learn more about a deadly plane crash that killed well-known Buffalo attorney Steve Barnes and his niece. Two on your sides, Jackie Roberts is there tonight with new information. Jackie. The crash happened in a wooded area on Boyce Road in Genesee County. The sheriff tells us the 911 call came in shortly before noon. And neighbors tell us they're still processing what happened. I never ever expected anything like that to happen, especially right across the street from my house. Olivia says she and her mom were home at the time of the crash. I just heard and felt this huge boom. Nothing like I had ever heard or felt before. And my mom yelled. <laughs> So I ran downstairs, we look out the front window, and we just see a plume of black smoke. And she called 911 immediately, and that's kind of where it escalated from there. The Genesee County Sheriff's Office, the Federal Aviation Administration, and the National Traffic Safety Board are all investigating the accident. Officials confirmed the TBM 700 aircraft coming from Manchester, New Hampshire, was on its way to Buffalo. Uh, it sounded like a, a loud winding noise as the plane was then observed going over a wooded area, dropped from the sky. The sheriff described the scene to reporters. See it's heavily wooded. There is a quite a crater that's been uh, into the ground. Um, pieces of airplane and aircraft uh, spread for hundreds of yards. The sheriff says at this point, no bodies have been recovered, but there do not appear to be any survivors. Multiple sources confirmed attorney Steve Barnes was the pilot of the plane with his niece also on the aircraft. There are still a lot of unknowns as to what led to the crash, and the sheriff says he's not sure how long the investigation will take, but from experience, he says it will likely be a considerable amount of time. In Genesee County, Jackie Roberts, Channel 2 News.